Hello everyone. This video is on a two-in-one multi-vendor de-stash haul. Um, so there are two de-stashes from two different sellers in this haul. Um, and they are multi-vendors, I guess, for the most part. Um, the first one I'm going to show you has mostly swanky because one, like, part of it is a sampler and there's like eight um, thingies in the sampler and then there's like a loaf and then there's like two things from two different other vendors and then the second one has rose girls, scribble tart wax, and vintage cheek scents. So let's hop into this goodness. So the first one that has mostly swanky, um, <laughs> I got a scent cup in the scent babysitters club. I do not know if this is a an extra or not um because i can't remember if i picked this out or not or she just gave it to me as an extra um and this is a new to me scent from them and it mostly oh man it smells good <laughs> it mostly just smells like a really yummy bakery scent um possibly cupcakes at tiffany's it smells really good um so then we have a Heart shape from Vintage Chic Scents in the scent Aunt Nellie's Sticky Marshmallow, which is creamy zucchini bread and gooey marshmallows, poured February 2023. And I think this is a new to me scent from them too. Oh yeah, and that just smells like a really creamy, really creamy and sweet zucchini. on cold. Yum. Okay. Now what's swanky? Um, and I should also like say before I like show some of the swinky goodies is um so I think it was like around the time when swinky first opened or like right after they opened or something like that um I don't know yeah anyway but I purchased my very first order from swinky in 2016 and I believe it was a custom order. Um, and I did not really get a whole lot of good throw from the wax then. Um, and I haven't purchased anything from her since then. And not because I hadn't, like at the time, it's not because I didn't want to try like different scents to see if I was going to get a better throw or something like something that wasn't like custom like maybe just what I had blended in the custom wasn't like a good idea or something I don't know um but because at the time like she was like really difficult like to get an order from like um her business like just started like booming like crazy I mean like it good for her of course I was like, man, like, I ain't got time for this. <laughs> like, I don't want to just, like, wait around and, like, you know, like, do the Hunger Games stuff. Because our, like, time I already had, like, a slew of other vendors I had to do the Hunger Games stuff with. Then, luckily, most of them are a lot, like, calmer and much easier to order from now. But at the time, I was already, like, I really didn't feel like ordering, like, adding another one of the Hunger Games vendors to my list of other ones to order from at the time. So I just, meh. But, um, I just, I don't know. I really, like, I don't know. I just, I would see, like, a lot of people, like, talking, like, in YouTube videos or, um, like, in wax chat type of groups about, like, how much they love her wax and her blends and all this stuff. And I'm like, well, it's been quite a while <laughs> and it seems to be a lot easier to order from her now so I went ahead and um grabbed or I snagged some goodies um oh and both of these de-stashes in this haul are uh CYOs create your your own de-stashes um so when I saw all these swanky goodies available in this first one I was like well let me give it a go <laughs> all right so anyway with all of that being said let's move on next to all the other goodies in here so we have a loaf which i know is crazy because like why would you get a loaf in a vendor that you tried like years and years ago 
with their throw and you didn't get a throw then, well, you never know. Maybe, um, like, like I said, like maybe the, the customs that I did, like the blends that I did were not very good. Um, maybe she's changed her wax formula since then. Um, maybe it was just <clears throat> the warmers that I was using then, like, or it could be all of who knows? So I really think that this scent sounded, um, really good. So I went and I grabbed it in a loaf anyway, and then, you know, the samplers or the sample were with the other goodies. Anyway, moving on, continuing to explain myself. <laughs> we have Cozy Mitten Strawberry Pound Cake. Obviously, all of these are going to be new to me since. <laughs> oh, wow, that smells good. I mean, most uncle, it just smells like a strawberry cake. There's some extra kind of like bakery goodness in there, but wow, that smells good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Beep. All right, moving on to the sampler items. And I think the sampler is called the sugar cookie sampler. Yes, I think so. Um, so first one of those is in strawberry rhubarb, rhubarb sugar cookie waffle cone. And I love that they're in these heart tins. That is adorable. Wow, it does smell like rhubarb. That is crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. Wow. And that is exactly what I pick up first on cold is the rhubarb. But it's like sweet. And then I pick up the strawberry. Wow, that is an interesting scent. Okay. And honestly, I think that's the like first time in a long time or maybe even like the first time ever before that I've gotten a rhubarb type of scent in wax. Um, next we have raspberry jam, bougie vanilla, and <laughs> sugar cookies. That's funny. Bougie. Mm, okay, so, so this raspberry is like a, like a perfumey raspberry. Okay, good to know. So this mostly just smells like that. Oh man, what is that? There is this, um... <laughs> this like body spray that younger girls like I remember it was like super popular when I was in like sixth grade <laughs> um but it's uh, body, uh like a raspberry body spray and like all the little girls are like wearing it and like thinking they they like brush it <laughs> that's what this smells like to me on cold that's exactly what that smells like wow okay um Next, we have Blackberry Sugar Cookie Buttercream Noel. Talk about delicious sounding. Holy cow. Mmm, that smells so good. Mmm, -hmm, mm -hmm. that smells like a yummy, creamy, sweet blackberry sugar cookie. Delicious. Um, next, we have Fireside Cream Cake Sugar Cookie Toaster Marshmallow. I'm not typically a fan of like the firesidey scents but it's in the sampler so we're gonna give it a go or at least a snicker in young cold yep okay so see and now okay <laughs> yeah that so mostly on cold i just smell like the um fireside marshmallow scent like the bath and body works type um which is actually one of my husband's favorite types of scents from bath and body works so, um, I'm going to let him give that a sniffer and see if he likes uncle. And if he does, then we, we will melt that only in his office because I don't think I would like that anymore. All right. Um, next we have lemon icebox meringue sugar cookie. Oh, left of it. Mm, that sounds good. Oh, wow. And it is good. Oh, that smells so good. That smells like the most delicious, creamy, yummy, sugary lemon ring pie. Mm -hmm. And then we have pink velvet sugar cookie, which is pink frosted cake, <laughs> zucchini, waffle cone, Noel, 
sugar cookies. Wow. It's really pretty pink, too. Now it's just shade pink. Mmm, that smells good. That smells like a yummy zucchini creamy sweet cake. Yum, yum, yum. Okay. And then we have pink sugar cookies, marshmallow noel. Oh, I like those. Those little, like, confetti, sprinkly, glittery thingies. That's pretty. Oh, yes. Okay. That smells delicious. Mm. Mm -hmm. Like a pink sugar, a pink sugar, sugar cookie scent. Yum, yum, yum. All right. I know that's probably annoying me saying yum, 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 but I mean, they're delicious. I mean, what you expect from me, y'all? <laughs> um, and then the last item in um, this sampler and in this part, uh, or in this de-stash part of the haul, um, and this first de-stash, <laughs> my, um, is blueberry sugar cookies. Oh, wow. Okay, I mean, it smells exactly as described. It smells like a blueberry sugar cookie. Yum. All right. So that is everything for um, the first de-stash in this haul. So let's move these on over here. Or at least some of them, anyway. Yeah, well. Oops. Okay. So do that. Okay, now the other, ow, um, the other de-stash in this haul, we have Rose Girls, and what is that, and Scoogle Blood Tart Wax, and VCS, Vintage Cheek Scents. So we will move on next to the VCS. We have two donuts. In Pink Dorothy, which is pink sugar, strawberry, white cake, and cotton candy, and both poured May 2021. Two of those, and I love this scent. This is a not new to me scent. So good. Oh, yeah. Such a pretty pink, uh, like a pink sugar cake. It's so good. Um, I don't really get much of the strawberry in that blend on cold or warm. But it is such a very pretty pink sugar cake scent that I just love. Oops. Um, next we have a souffle in Sweeney's Barbershop, which is fresh strawberries blended with mint shaving cream poured September 2021. I love this scent. As most people do who are fans of UCS. It's oh man, it's so good. It is just so good. I don't oh. I love it. Like the shaving, like the minty shaving cream that she uses is just phenomenal. And then mixed with the strawberries. Oh, chest kiss. So good. Um, oh, and then we have um and like a Sweeney's Barbershop um rose or blossom. And this was poured in August 2021. Yeah, love that. Oh, so good. Um, and then we'll move on next to the Rose Girls in this de-stash. We have um, Badger State Hot Cocoa, which is hot cocoa, peppermint, and marshmallow smoothie. This is a not new to me scent. Um, I, like, I could, you know, take it or leave it with, like, most chocolate scents and wax, I guess, but, like, when it comes to like Christmassy time and you get like a like a hot cocoa and minty scent, I mean that just to me like screams Christmas and that's exactly what this is on cold and on warm to me. It's like dipping your candy cane in hot cocoa. Mm, love that and I love to do that. I think it's delicious. Next we have jam and jelly, which is strawberry jam, a raspberry sauce, blueberry cobbler, blackberry jam, butter cookies, and peach cake. This is a new to me scent, I think, from them. Hmm. Interesting. I feel like I get the raspberry sauce and blackberry jam mostly on cold. I 
keep the um, strawberry and blueberry come out more and more, though. Um, whoops. And then we have a um, chunk muffin and dragon fruit fizzy pops. And I think I've had this one before from them. Oh, and just mostly on cold, I get fizzy pops. It's just, oh my gosh, she's got such a good fizzy pop fragrance oil. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> um, and then we have Sherbert Land, which is blue sugar, vanilla ice cream, snow powder, and cool mint. And this is a new to me scent. And um, when I saw this on the like CYO thing that the seller, the list that the seller had up, I was like, I don't think I've even seen that scent before from Rose Rolls. And I was like, I don't know what snow powder is. And blue sugar mixed with ice cream and cold mint and whatever snow powder is sounds very intriguing. It's been a while since I've had a blue sugar scent anyway, so let's give this a few Oh, wow. Okay. So I get the blue sugar first on cold. And then like a mint, like a creamy mintiness. So I really don't know what the snow powder is. So I'm gonna have to look that up, but that sounds lovely. And then we'll move on next to the um, Skibble Tart Wax in this tea stash. We have strawberry jam cream cake, which is strawberry jam and strawberries and cream. And this is a new to me scent from them. Mm, that smells so good. And mostly on cold, I just get the strawberry jam. That smells so good. Wow. Yummies. And then we have Luke's Diner, which is absolute coffee, pancakes, pumpkin pecan waffles, and vanilla crunch donuts. And I don't think this is a need to be sent from them. Oh, that's all good. The pumpkin pecan waffles and the coffee is mostly what I get on cold. And it smells delicious. Delicious. I do think it sweetens up more on warm though, from what I can remember. And then the last item in this de stash and in this haul video is Crazy Pants, or a loaf in Crazy Pants, which is strawberry jam and green apples, or green apple. And this is a not new to me scent from them. Oh, and it's so good. The green apple mixed with the strawberry is just. It's so good. So, so good. I love that. And it is crazy. <laughs> oh, that is yummy. All right. Well, that is everything for my most recent two multi-vendor de-stashes haul. <laughs> um, thank you all so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.